Hey, what's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you the second pickup capsule for the month of October. In this pickup capsule, you have three days to try to get one of the zooms in here or even try to clear it. So you have until end of day, October the 26th to try to get it. Now, if you're able to clear the entire pickup capsule, meaning that you could get all 15 zooms from this pickup capsule, then at the very end, you'll get the last prize, which is a skill ticket. It is a little bit more difficult if you don't have the coins, but if you have 450,000 coins saved up, you definitely should invest in this pickup capsule. So let's take a look at the six that we have. So first soon we have one copy of Bat Hat Mini, two copies of Vampire Teddy Bear, three copies of Locke, three copies of Ghost Dale, three copies of Horn Hat Mickey, and then three copies of Pumpkin Mini. Now there's not that many good zooms in here, but there is one amazing zoom to get and that's Bat Hat Mini. Now there's only one copy in here, but I still think it's really worth it to invest in getting Bat Hat Mini at least to skill level one if you don't have Bat Hat Mini yet. And the reason for that is uh, she maxes out at skill level three. So all you really need to do is invest two skill tickets on her and you will max out Bat Hat Mini. Bat Hat Mini is a very good zoom to get a lot of coins, especially early on, especially if you don't have a lot of skill tickets or if you are newer to the game. Bat Hat Mini, if you play a really good game, you could get upwards of 4,000 base coins without any boost or anything like that. And she is going to be assumed that is worth using your skill tickets on, as well as using the coin boost when you are playing her at skill level 3. Skill level 2, not so much, but I definitely think that you should try to max out Bat Hat Mini to skill level 3. And by the way guys, if you guys are enjoying this type of content for Zoom Zoom, consider subscribing to this channel, it really helps me out a lot. And like I mentioned earlier, if you are able to clear the entire pickup capsule, meaning get all the Zooms from here, which is 15 of them, that's going to cost you 450,000 coins. And for this particular pickup capsule, I really do think that it's worth it because you have Bat Hat Mini in there. Now, if you don't have 450,000 coins saved up, I still think that you should spend as many coins as possible to try to get Bat Hat Mini because that is really going to be a really good sim for you to get. Now, without further ado, let me show you the gameplay for all of these sims and I particularly want to show you Bat Hat Mini to talk you through why this is a really good sim and why you should invest in this sim at all. So here's the gameplay for Bat Hat Mini and Bat Hat Mini is from the Mickey and Friends series and she is going to be one of the best zooms that you could get in the Mickey and Friends series. And her ability is very simple. Uh, when you activate her ability, a bunch of bats will show up. At skill level 3, there's going to be a total of 10 bats. Now, these bats that will show up are random. They're not particularly placed in any special position or anything like that. So they will show up at any position. If you have good luck, then all the bats will be scattered throughout the entire gameplay. And that's exactly what you want. And a strategy here is you want to tap the bats strategically. You want to alternate left to right or top to bottom. You don't necessarily want to try to pop everything at once either. For Bat Hat Mini, you could technically swipe your finger and touch all the bats and pop them all at once, but that's actually not the most optimal way to play. And the best thing to do here is you want to try to tap each bat individually. So for example, let's say you tap the top left corner, then you want to go to the bottom right corner and then go to the bottom left and then top right and then center and so forth. Now, of course, it's not going to be perfect. So you just do the best that you can. So each gameplay will be different depending on how many bats you get. And also what you should strive to do is just focus on clearing bat hat minis off the screen. The more bat hat minis you clear off the screen, the more abilities you'll be able to activate. So therefore earning you more coins. So for bat hat mini, every gameplay you should strive for 3,000 to 4,000 coins. For this particular gameplay, I got 3,469 coins. So not too bad. And I am playing without the coin boost on. But I purposely did that so I could show you the base coin earning. And then if you have the coin boost, of course, you're going to get more. So this is why Bat Hat Mini is a really good sim for beginners or any accounts that don't have a lot of skill tickets. All you really need is two skill tickets and one copy of Bat Hat Mini, which you could get right here. And if you guys are looking to see gameplays for the rest of these zooms, definitely check them out. You could slide the time bar or check out the timestamps in the description below and you'll be able to jump to the zooms that you're looking for. Out, honestly, out of these other six, they're not that great, but I do find Horn Hat Mickey really fun to play. I enjoy moving the bats around, so I actually enjoy Horn Hat Mickey more than Bat Hat Mini, just because I find moving the bats around or moving the little bubbles around is pretty fun, and 
that's another zoom that I really enjoy. So out of these six zooms that are available, I really like Horn Hat Mickey and also Bat Hat Mini. So good luck in trying to get one of these zooms. And if you guys enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing to this channel. And as always, thank you so much for watching.